earthquakes. They are sudden and powerful shaking events caused by the movement of tectonic plates beneath the Earth's surface. This movement occurs along faults where immense pressure builds up over time due to the plates grinding against each other. When this pressure is released, seismic waves travel through the ground, causing shaking that can last from a few seconds to minutes. Earthquakes can topple buildings, cause landslides, and trigger tsunamis if they occur under the ocean. Their intensity is measured using the Richter or moment magnitude scales, while their effects depend on factors like proximity to the epicenter, depth, and local building infrastructure. They remind us of the dynamic, restless nature of Earth's crust. Volcanic eruptions. They occur when magma from beneath the Earth's crust rises to the surface, driven by intense heat and pressure. These eruptions can vary from slow lava flows to explosive events, ejecting ash, gas, and pyroclastic material high into the atmosphere. Volcanoes are classified as active, dormant, or extinct, depending on their activity levels. Ash clouds can disrupt air travel, cause health issues, and lead to long-term environmental changes, while lava can destroy everything in its path. Some eruptions, like supervolcanoes, can have global effects by altering the climate. Despite their destructive potential, volcanoes also create fertile soils and shape stunning landscapes. Tsunamis. They are massive ocean waves triggered primarily by undersea earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, or landslides. These waves can travel at speeds of up to 500 miles per hour across vast ocean basins, often unnoticed in deep water. However, as they approach shallow coastal areas, they grow in height, sometimes reaching over 100 feet, before crashing onto land. The immense force of tsunamis can wipe out entire towns, uproot vegetation, and flood coastal regions. Their devastating impact often leads to significant loss of life and property. Early warning systems and education about evacuation routes are vital to reducing the damage caused by these deadly waves. Hurricanes, cyclones, and typhoons. They are all tropical storms with strong winds exceeding 74 miles per hour, differing only in their location. They form over warm ocean waters when rising moist air creates a low-pressure center, drawing in more air and forming a spinning system. These storms bring torrential rain, powerful winds, and storm surges, causing flooding, widespread destruction, and loss of life. Coastal areas are particularly vulnerable, with storm surges flooding low-lying regions. Despite advancements in forecasting, their unpredictable paths and rapid intensification remain a challenge. Hurricanes are rated on the Saffir-Simpson scale, which categorizes them based on sustained wind speeds. Tornadoes. They are violently rotating columns of air extending from thunderstorms to the ground. Formed during severe storms, they occur when warm, moist air collides with cold, dry air, creating instability in the atmosphere. Tornadoes are typically short-lived but incredibly destructive, with winds reaching speeds of over 300 miles per hour. They can uproot trees, destroy buildings, and hurl debris over long distances. Tornado-prone regions like the United States... Tornado Alley experience these events frequently. The enhanced Fujita scale measures their intensity based on damage. Although highly localized, tornadoes are among nature's most unpredictable and concentrated forces of destruction. Floods. They occur when water overwhelms land that is usually dry, often due to heavy rainfall, river overflow, storm surges, or dam failures. They are among the most common and widespread natural disasters, affecting urban and rural areas alike. Flash floods happen suddenly, with little warning, and can sweep away people, vehicles, and buildings. River floods occur more gradually but can persist for weeks, causing extensive property damage and loss of agricultural land. Floodwaters can also spread diseases and disrupt infrastructure, leaving long-term effects. Mitigation efforts like dams, levees, and proper urban planning are crucial for reducing flood risk. Droughts, they are prolonged periods of abnormally low rainfall, leading to water shortages that affect agriculture, ecosystems, and human populations. They develop slowly, often over months or years, and can persist for extended periods, making them silent disasters. Crops fail, rivers dry up, and wildlife suffers due to the lack of water, leading to food insecurity and economic hardship. Droughts also increase the risk of wildfires as dry vegetation becomes highly flammable. Climate change is expected to worsen drought conditions in many parts of the world.
emphasizing the need for better water management and conservation strategies. Landslides. They are the sudden downward movement of rock, soil, or debris along a slope, often triggered by heavy rainfall, earthquakes, volcanic eruptions, or human activities like deforestation. These events can bury roads, homes, and entire villages under tons of debris, causing significant loss of life and infrastructure damage. Landslides can also block rivers, creating dams that may eventually fail and cause flooding downstream. Areas with steep slopes, unstable geology, and deforested land are particularly vulnerable. While difficult to predict, monitoring systems and proper land use practices can help reduce the risk and impact of landslides. Wildfires. They are uncontrolled fires that spread rapidly through vegetation, often ignited by lightning, human negligence, or arson. These fires thrive in hot, dry conditions and are fueled by flammable vegetation, such as dry grass and trees. Once started, they can spread quickly, consuming forests, grasslands, and even urban areas. Wildfires produce thick smoke, reduce air quality, and threaten lives, homes, and wildlife. They also contribute to climate change by releasing large amounts of carbon dioxide. Fire prevention measures, such as controlled burns and public awareness campaigns, are critical for managing wildfire risks in fire-prone regions. Blizzards. They are severe snowstorms characterized by strong winds over 35 miles per hour and reduced visibility due to blowing snow. They form when cold air meets warm, moist air, creating heavy snowfall and wind. Blizzards can last for hours or even days, paralyzing regions with impassable roads, power outages, and extreme cold. Frostbite and hypothermia are major risks for anyone exposed to these conditions. In addition to snow accumulation, Blizzards can cause roof collapses and disrupt critical infrastructure. Preparedness, such as stocking emergency supplies and staying indoors, is essential for surviving these icy, life-threatening storms.